According to Murphy's Law, anything that can happen will happen. Wait, what is it? What? If anything can go wrong, it will go wrong. Why would he say? And at the worst possible moment. You know what? Who is this Murphy guy anyway? Scratch everything I said up to this point right now. I'm going to be going to 100 drive throughs today, which is just slightly more than the norm. But uh, I'm going to be asking for discounts. And let me tell you why. Let me tell you. The first reason is that to save money. <laughs> I think it'd be pretty cool to see how malleable these prices are, you know? I have always wanted to negotiate for a Big Mac. The second reason is that, well, I, I went on this road trip like a year ago and I found out about this theory. And it's the idea that asking for 10% off of your next coffee order will make you more confident, social, and successful. <laughs> Research suggests that you have like a five second window to decide whether or not you're gonna do something that scares you. If you don't act within that five second window, then the odds are that you're not gonna do it at all. So I think you get the idea. I actually tried doing this on that road trip I was telling you about, and the video is on YouTube, so it went like this. Can I get a vanilla latte? And can I get 10% off by chance? Yeah. <laughs> what, I'm sorry? Can I get 10% off? 10% off? Yeah. For? I, I just appreciate it, that'd be sweet. Well, 4 dollars for you. <laughs> and you can decide if that's 10% off or not. Alright. <laughs> she totally just gave me 10% off. It worked! And it was fun. And I saved like 50 cents. Suck on that, Murphy. Literally yesterday, I was getting ready to film this video, and I got an email from this brand. I've been using their service for like 8 months. And whenever I saw that they wanted to sponsor my video, I was like, There's no way. You'll never believe what I'm filming tomorrow. I've been using Honey for as long as I can remember, several months now. Honey is a free browser extension that automatically finds the best promo codes whenever you shop online. They're on over 37,000 sites. You got Amazon, Urban Outfitters, Sephora, Best Buy, Walmart, and, and so much more. Like, it's crazy how many stores that I shop online at that I can just save money on. One sec. I do so much of my shopping on Amazon, so just knowing that like I'm getting the best price at all times is such a relief off my, it's a stress off my shoulders, or it's a weight off, it's a chip off my, sh I don't know. It's something off my shoulder, it's great, is all I know. Thank you, honey. So I'm gonna go to joinhoney.com slash Ryan, literally takes two clicks to install, one, two, and you're done, you're saving money. Listen, there's literally no reason not to use Honey for everything you buy online. It's free to use, installs in just two clicks, and please use my link. You can get Honey for free at joinhoney.com slash Ryan. That is joinhoney.com slash Ryan. Thank you so much to Honey for uh, giving my viewers the option to not be uncomfortable and to not ask for discounts like I'm going to be doing in this video. <laughs> You'll see how much of a challenge it is to personally go out and try to negotiate better deals and try to save money. So I thought it was just the perfect integration and I could not be more thrilled to be working with a brand that I love so much. So without further ado, let's go to the drive through <laughs> Okay, so we're going to the first fast food restaurant drive through of the entire challenge. Looks like a Wendy's. I don't know what I'm gonna like order. Cause if I'm doing this many drive throughs I don't wanna have $500. I have an idea. There's like a really big homeless population here. So I think I'll just like get some meals, probably some ice cream cones as well. And just, oh God, I'm about to get smacked by a truck. And then I'll just give it away. Oh my gosh, there's like four restaurants here. This is perfect. All right, here we go. We're going to Wendy's. Step out of your comfort zone, Ryan. Hi, yeah, uh, can I get, can I get a spicy chicken sandwich? Okay, anything else? Um, yeah, can I get 10% off of that? I'm sorry? Can I get like a 10% discount? No. That'll be it then. Okay, it'd be... Okay, thank you. Thank you. I mean, she was straight up about it. She just literally said, no, you, you can't have that. I'm not gonna ask questions. 99 to go. Thank you. Have a good day. Thanks. Thank she did not seem happy with me. I'm hoping that throughout this video, you can see my confidence kind of like build up just like the sunlight on my face a little overexposed is what i'm trying to say so we're literally driving right like 20 feet away to the kfc and then there's a taco bell and then there's a popeyes where am i honestly if one of these like big chain franchises give me a discount i'm gonna be surprised wait where the heck where do i oh i order up here hold up oh there we go i missed it can i get a crispy kernel sandwich yeah just by itself yeah regular and um can i get like 10 percent off of that Huh? All right, oh, that'll be it. I must be on the rude side of town, jeez. Over there we got a no, and over here we got a uh, no. 
which is even more sassy. So hopefully I don't get absolutely punched in the face when I pull up to this window. The interesting thing is there's such a variety of how people respond to this. Like when I used to do this off camera, I did this like, like last summer on a road trip. It was like the highlight of people's day. <laughs> but I guess, I don't know. I totally understand like, whoa, what's going on? Oh, that's just my credit card flashing in my eyes telling me to stop this challenge right now. So far, over two. And I also probably made two enemies in the process. This is actually taking a really long time, so I'm gonna turn the camera off. I will be right back so you can catch me getting punched in the face. Let's go. Hello, B432. All right, sorry about that, <laughs> thanks. I didn't even realize I was done because she didn't say like, have a good day or anything. Uh, I'm not even petty. I'm not, I'm not being salty. I'm having a great day. This video is sponsored by Honey. All right, Taco Bell. Literally, it's Wendy's KFC Taco Bell Popeyes. What's behind the Popeyes? McDonald's? That wouldn't surprise me. I feel like it just might be this side of town. I genuinely am thinking that right now. Let's go for it. You already know what I'm gonna get. Hello, how are you doing today? What can I get for you? I'm doing good, how are you? I'm doing great, thank you for asking. Yeah, of course. Um, can I get a, a two Dorito Locos tacos? You know, that's gonna be it, but can I get 10% off? I'm sorry? Can I get 10% 10, 10 off the order? Um, I'd have to get a manager on that, I'm sorry. Okay, no worries. Any drinks? No, that'll be it, actually. Okay. Thank Any you so much. Do Sure. Thank you. Somehow, I, I walked out of that thing donating money. I thought I was trying to save money. Yeah, it sounds like these people don't have the authority to give discounts. Hello, how are you doing? Hi, uh, good, good. You have yourself a wonderful day? You too, take care. Have a good one. Ooh, I'll take it. See, you know what? I didn't get the discount, but that lady's service was worth the 10% I paid. That was fantastic, she was so sweet. Yo, I don't even wanna go to Popeyes, low key. I go to Popeyes. It's like a nationally known meme that they are just absolutely insane to their customers. <laughs> okay, I, yeah, I'm gonna go to a different side of town. All right, so far 0 for three. So that's absolutely awful. Probably the worst result we could possibly yield thus far. In fact, there's no probably about it. So now I have three bags of food right here. We'll see if there's anyone who needs it more than I do. There's a McDonald's. Ooh, Taco Cabana. God, I'm gonna hit you. Oh shoot. I feel like the farther we kind of stray from from those like nationally massive fast food joints, the more likely we're gonna be to get that discount. Pulling up now, pulling up. Hey, how's it going? Um, can I get a chicken only taco? Yeah, chicken mojito taco. Alright, anything else? Can I get 10% off of that, by the way? Huh? Can I get 10% off by chance? You say that one more time, please? Oh, can I get like 10% off by chance? 10% off for what? Um, of the, of the meal. The only way you get that is if you're a um, policeman, EMT, fireman, or a serviceman, or a Oh, uh, I'm none of those things. Okay, uh, that'll be it then. All right, have a good one. Thanks. I want to reaffirm my lack of success with the fact that this has worked before for me, but it's always been in person and not a drive through And the thing about drive throughs is there aren't that many, like, locations that have a drive through They're like a mom and pop shop, you know? Most drive throughs are massive, massive corporations. All right, pulling up to Whataburger, let's go. So we're 0 for 4, according to the m number of bags I have. Hey, how's it going? Good, how are you doing today? Good, thanks. Um, can I get a number one with only cheese and ketchup? I'm not gonna get a meal, just the, just the sandwich. Is there any way at all I could get 10% off my order, though? A what? Is there any way at all I could get 10% off? I do apologize. Oh, uh, okay. Um, we don't, we don't do that. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. All right. Well, that'll be it then. Thank you. They don't do that. I mean, I wouldn't do that either, to be completely fair. Thanks. Have a good one. I feel like everyone thinks I'm going to, like, prank them or something. <laughs> Who needs discounts anyway? Well, to be fair, me. Especially when I'm buying this many foods. I'm not giving up, okay? I'm... It might be really dark in here. Oh, never mind. It's oh, it's dark again. And now it's bright. Now it's dark. Now it's bright. It might be extremely bright in here, and I might be very hot. And my car might smell like deep fried everything. But that doesn't mean I'm gonna give up. It's not who I am. We're gonna get 10% off. I will not upload this video until we get 10% off. Okay. I feel like this is gonna be a more likely scenario. So every time I asked for 10% off, it was at a coffee place, and I would say it was about a 50% success rate. I'm in a Starbucks right now. So we got the coffee element, but we still have that fast food element, which is very harmful to our goal. Thanks for choosing Starbucks. What can we get for you? Hey, thank you. Um, can I get a 
tall cafe latte in a paper cup. Uh, tall cafe latte in a paper cup? Yeah, iced, sorry. Okay, tall iced latte in a paper cup. Yeah. Okay, anything else for you? Um, this might sound crazy and I wouldn't even blame you if you said no, but can I get 10% off by chance? Um, yeah, I don't really know what you're talking about. Are you talking like an employee discount or? Well, yeah, just like, like a 10% off discount. I don't work here. This is the first time anybody's asked me for this. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> she said that was the first time anyone's asked, which is fair. I don't blame her for not being asked that yet. That one made me a little uncomfortable for some reason, because I felt like she was uncomfortable. Okay. Thank you. Dude, the lady who was taking my order had it up to here with me. She looked at me from like in the back of the kitchen and was like, based on like the precedent of me doing it before this, I'm surprised at people's like lack of interest or like, I don't know if they think it's a prank or like if I'm just being a brat. That one definitely made me the most uncomfortable for some reason. I got like a weird feeling in my stomach. I guess I could just feel her like attitude not reciprocating because I was having very good vibes coming up in that drive-thru and it just didn't, didn't go the way I wanted it. All right, see you at the next place. Okay, we've officially made it to the bougiest McDonald's in the state of Texas. So here we go, here goes nothing. I just got that feeling in my stomach again. That's the lack of confidence that comes from awkward interactions. The line is super long. Here we go. Hello, please pull forward to the next speaker. Thanks. Okay. I love that they put Mick in front of everything. Mick delivery now available on Uber Eats. Hello. Please move forward to the next speaker. Hi. Thanks. Damn. Thanks for choosing McDonald's. How can I help you? Hey, thank you. Um, can I get a four-piece McNugget, a McDouble, and a McDiscount? Uh, four-piece McNugget. What kind of sauce? I think I'm gonna go with barbecue. And a McDouble. Anything else? Oh yeah, McDiscount. A discount. A McDis. Can I get ten percent off? <laughs> can you pull up to one? Cause I can barely hear you. Oh yeah. All right. All right. I thought I had a little bit of humor. <laughs> I left all the one thing she couldn't hear us when I was asking for a discount. <laughs> At least she didn't say no in a rude way, you know? The McDouble, the four-piece nugget, and what else would you like? A discount. 10% oh, off. Okay. I said a Mick discount. Uh, okay, you go to 367. All right, thank you. She didn't even fathom the possibility of actually giving me a discount. She just went, oh, okay. That'll be 367. Double. Yes, thank you so much. Have a good one. You too, take care. We have so much food and I paid full price for all of it. I no longer feel threatened for my life for asking for a discount. So, oh, is there a Raising Cane's? I'm going to Raising Cane's. It's a chicken place here. I feel like it's very rare. Not very rare, it's just a smaller franchise. I'm gonna get a discount here. I'm gonna use the Law of Attraction and I'm gonna get a discount. I'm so grateful for this discount I got at Raising Cane's. Hi, um, can I get, can I get the kids combo? Or am I not allowed? No, oh, yeah, you can do what you want. Okay, uh, let's see, let's see. I'll get a high C. I might as well go full kid mode. A kid's combo with a, high, a kid's high C? Yeah. Anything else? Um, this might sound crazy, but can I get 10% off of that? Uh, for why? It would, it would honestly, like, make my day. Oh, I can't do that, I'm sorry. Oh, that's all right. Thank you, nonetheless. I'll pull up now. <laughs> I thought that was gonna be the one. I feel like I half expected her to say, Ah, okay. 10% off is like 50 cents when you really think about it. But if they just started giving 10% off to everyone, then it's a massive corporation and downfall and then uh, they go bankrupt. Hi. Thank you. So they say whenever you die and reach the gates of heaven, you're greeted by a Chick-fil-A worker. So I'm hoping this one works. I am pulling up to Chick-fil-A right now. There are two individuals. Here goes nothing. Good, how are you? Do well, make it a name for your order. Ryan. Can I get start for you? Uh, can I get a grilled chicken sandwich with uh, no lettuce or tomato? What else for you? Uh, I'm gonna substitute the fries for a fruit cup and then get a sweet tea. Okay. Yeah. Anything else? Um, this might sound crazy, but can I get 10% off <laughs> by chance? For? It would, it would make my day. I'm going to 100 drive throughs right now and trying to see if I can get 10% off. Really? At any of them. Yeah, I got a lot of food. I'm gonna give it oh, away to man. the homeless after this, but yeah. it's an hey, experiment. If it's, if it's for the homeless, yeah, you got it. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. No, I'll, I'll That's number one of like 20. <laughs> I'll do 50% off. 50% off. Gotcha. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate it. Uh, 491. Thank you so much. I appreciate okay. you. Take care. Yes! That dude just gave me 50% off. I didn't try to guilt trip him because I really am giving this away to the homeless. I don't know if he's a manager here. I don't know if he like, if Chick-fil-A's just got this policy where like, hey, 
if you come across someone who's doing a good deed, give them food for like a fraction of the cost. But that was insane. Half off. Dang. That almost counts as like five restaurants in one. Whoa, wait. I guess it kind of helps that I have so much food in my passenger seat. That's not even all of it. That was location 20 and he just gave us half off at Chick-fil-A. So at least we have one success. Oh my goodness. This is what I'm talking about though, guys. This was the one drive through out of 20 that I had a face-to-face, one-on-one interaction with someone, and it was the successful one. Like, I think there's some sort of, some sort of science backing that up. I'm thrilled to pick up my food right now. Not only that, he complimented my sweater while he was at it. The theory about the gates of heaven, 100% confirmed. Dude, now my confidence, up here. Hi, Ryan. Yes. Here we are. And Sweet. Tea. Yes, thank you so Have much. You too. Thank you. Can I get a cheeseburger? I think that's gonna be it, but um, is there any chance, I know this is kind of crazy, is there any chance I can get 10% off? No. <laughs> okay, gotcha. Thank you. Thanks, he said, no. <laughs> I can honestly say that throughout this challenge, I've gotten pretty much impenetrable by what people respond with. I could ask for a discount and they could be like, sorry, we don't give discounts to ugly people. Okay, that would probably hurt my feelings now that I think about it. But that's not the point. The point is my confidence on the up and up. My bank account on the d down and down. Thank you so much. You too. All right, I'm gonna go give it them away now. Hey, excuse me. I got some food. You mind sharing that with these guys? Yeah. I got some more. Hey, thank you, dude. Yes, sir. God of course. bless you. Yeah, have a good one. I got a little bit more. I got some more. I appreciate it. Yeah. Thank you, buddy. That's the rest of it, thanks. Have a good one. You too. There are a few of them that didn't get a piece of food, so I gave him the rest, but that's the last of it. I really think the face-to-face -face interaction changes everything. And it may be my charming smile. It's not that. There's some sort of difference in the social psychology of the interaction when it's face-to-face. -face. Anyways, I'll see you tomorrow. All right, day two. I actually decided not to start off with the face-to-face -face interactions for two reasons. One of them being, I think uh, it's illegal. That's a, oh, Lucas is here as well. <laughs> Bonjour. Bonjour. So uh, we're going to our first place right now. This looks like a custard place, but the good thing is I don't think this location is like a big franchise, right? No. It's called Shakes. It's a mom and pop place. It's definitely mom and pop. Okay, so what do you want? You want to get a cone? Just a vanilla cone. Vanilla cone. Dude, we're getting 10% off. Hi. Hi, how's it going? Good, what can I get for you? Okay. Um, can we get just one vanilla cone? Anything else? Can we get 10% off? <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> They would just make my day, honestly. That'd be fantastic. Dude, Take care. Have a great day. Here you go. Oh, dude, there's seven here. Oh, we're hitting all of these. There's a Whataburger, KFC, McDonald's, Chipotle, Subway. I don't know if, how many of these are actually. Hey, how's it going? Oh, I'm pretty good. How about you? Good. Thank you for asking. I am going to get a Hunger Buster, just the sandwich. Yeah, I heard you guys had like a deal going on, 10% off. We don't. Oh. Have a good day. I guess we'll go to Whataburger again. I'm gonna ask for the senior citizen discount. Can I get a number one with only cheese and ketchup? I'm actually just gonna get the sandwich. Just the sandwich? Yes. Um, one more thing. Can I get 10% off by chance? I'm sorry? Can I get a 10% discount? Like, how old do you have to be for the senior citizen discount? If I could get a 10% discount, that would be insanely awesome. All right. Anything else today? No. Thank you. Well, we finished off the challenge with over 30 more fast food chains, all of which said something along the lines of no. I learned that this theory really only works face to face and that some people can take this the wrong way, so I wouldn't recommend you try doing this. Do try giving to the less fortunate though, because that made me really happy and made every rejection worth it. Please smash like button if you enjoyed. I feel like I learned a lot from this video. Definitely don't ask for discounts at a drive-thru. We saved some money thanks to Chick-fil-A. You could save some money thanks to Honey. That was insanely, what's the word? I was gonna say rhythmic. Oh, that was rhymy. Anyways, please subscribe if you're new to the channel. Uh, hit the post notification bell. Otherwise, you will not see my videos. You will not get notified. Smash the bell. Thomas Jefferson did something with the bell. Like the Liberty Bell? Yeah. Ben Franklin? Ben Franklin, did he hit the bell or did he? Do, do hit the bell. Check me out on Instagram, at Trahan, and check out my second channel, Ryan Trahan IRL, for all things IRL in real life that no one wants to see. With that being said,